A common question that we receive about printers is what to do when the printer prints too many of one item or you want to stop printing something that is not printing correctly. So let's say for example I want to print my website and I accidentally typed in I wanted 150 copies. Well as I start seeing my printer throw out all of those copies, the first thing you want to do is reach over and shut the printer off. After you shut the printer off, you should get a notice similar to this. It'll look different on different versions of Windows, but it'll tell you that the printer is offline, and it'll give you the opportunity right then and there to cancel printing. If you've already forgotten that part and you're beyond that already, the next thing you want to do is display the print queue. And what that will bring up is this window that has not changed since Windows 98, actually since Windows 95, and all it is is a little screen showing you the name of the document, who sent it, how many pages it is, etc. And at this point, all you need to do is click on the document, click Document from the menus, and then Cancel. Or if you have multiple documents, click Printer from the menus, and then click Cancel All Documents. If you don't see that little Cancel option down in the tray by your clock, the next thing you need to do is look for the small printer if it's available by your clock. In my case it isn't. So then you're going to go to your start button, go to the control panel. In the control panel you're going to go to your printers and at this point you'll double click on the printer that's having the problem and then you'll get back to that same dialog box we looked at earlier where you can select the item you want to delete click printer from the menu and cancel all documents or document cancel either one works and it says are you sure definitely say yes in a few moments the problem document will disappear in some cases you may have to repeat that process a couple of times keep the printer off and then shut your computer off turn your computer back on check this dialog box again to make sure everything is cleared before turning your printer back on. So that's how you can get yourself out of trouble when you have printing problems.